but the way I'm touching you is you can't you can't say you are feeling pain. <laughs> it's only when you have a dream of that you will feel like you've been beaten by a brick. So you will respond. Lift him up. So what are you doing to this boy? <laughs> huh? I'm gonna call my demons. You say what? I'm gonna call my demons. You are calling your demons. What's about you? Huh? Who are you? Can you just take a boy? This boy. <laughs> you say what are you doing? You are calling your demons. Yes. To come here. Yes. Mm. So you have your own demons. Yes. So who are you? I'm Satan. You're Satan. Yes. So who came with this boy? Huh? It's me, Pastor. So he's your son? It's my your grandson. grandson. So you know he's, he's in the dark. He's got a problem. Huh? He's got a problem. He's not. Okay. Yes, he's my family, sir. You know, yes, he's a, he's a grandchild to my sister, and this one it destroys everything. Whatever he sees, he eats everything. He eats his nails. He eats everything. The clothes. He eats it finished, and he doesn't listen. He doesn't listen, sir. So you can hear the spirit in him. You say you're what? A demon. I'm Satan. You're Satan. Yes. You've got your demons. Yes. So why do you make him to eat everything? Uh, well, have you ever seen him like this? No, he never been like this. Eh? Uh, yeah. So you just have anger. Just now today sin. you know that there's a spirit in him called Satan. Think about your... He's not at school, Pastor. He's not even going to school. When he, when he, when he started at school, the teachers were complaining. He can't catch anything. Think about it. And then I took him to the Center. How old? How old is he, Mama? He's eleven now. My God, I'm beginning to worry now about our children. That now, if now you see a child like this, you you remember your own now. Have you ever prayed for your own? What about the demons in our children? You know, even our children might be having some demons, and you just look at the character, the anger, the what what. Huh? At the age, at the age, he was very powerful. He was very proud. And then they attacked him. They called him a pastor they in the area. At a very early age. After that, he started not catching up at school everywhere. And, so, and he's getting um, Satan, a lot of accidents. I want to tell you, Satan will never attack what is not going anywhere. You know, sometimes when you, you don't have problems, it's because you're not going anywhere. You see, you see a boy like So what are you doing to this boy? And what are you doing to the family? I destroy them. You destroy them? Yes. And what, tell, tell me things that you, are, you say you are destroying family. One, you are doing what? I'm certain. You are certain? Yes. You are destroying them? Yes. So... Is there any people who are dying in your family? Or just to destroy, you are losing things? The, the uncles, the uncles, the brother of the sister, they all died. Both of them, they, 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 they mysteri mysteriously. Since he was born, so they, are, died. Are they died. Are you aware of that? Are you the one who's yes. killing the, all those uncles? Yes. And what are you doing to this <laughs> grandma? I kill him. You kill who? This grandma. You are if it's not my grandma. Is what? It's my demon. Hey, your grandma is your demon. Mama. You can't write. It's can't amazing. He's speaking he's, so well like that. He's speaking right English. Yes. He can't, he can't, yeah? I am, I'm even shocked. You are shocked. That he speaks English like this. He can't. Uh, you are shocked, you people. I'm shocked. I'm uh, shocked you think Satan is. He's a very strange English, this one, sir. It's not this boy. It's not this boy. Now you are shocked. Even you can talk Portuguese today. <laughs> you, you, don't, you, know, you know us, 
It goes by which demon has entered you. I'm sure you understand that. Yes. So you are shocked. You say, I'm destroying them. It's not even what word. And he can't even write English. Every time you so you are together, sir? No. no. This, one is together. this one is my wife. Yeah. Every time you tear something up, my heart is like. You feel it's something. Up. It doesn't have even clothes. The man, no, I throw them away. You just break everything. If you see him in the, coming out of the house, he's like, he's like somebody who stay out. Who doesn't have a home? He breaks the clothes. It's like everything is. Where his parents are? <laughs> the mother is in Cape Town. Huh? The mother the is mother in Cape Town, sir. I raised him when he was three months. The mother went back to school because she was she was at school in in, in Cape Town. Not long. I was telling people that God uses rejected uh, children. I was, I was telling you that God can use the rejected children. Because, uh, when we were preparing to come here in Eastern Cape Sea, demons came in my place. I saw them. They started accusing you. They asked me, where, where am I taking these people to? Because you are an evil person. And then by the time you were talking about that here now, I, I looked at my sister and then she agreed that this is exactly all the accusation that the demons were saying, um, I shouldn't bring these people here because the last time I was here. They came to your room. They came to my, not only once, they came many times and then they did a lot of things along telling the way. Telling you. They're telling me personally. Why taking the that way, that you, you are an evil man. And then they show me everything that what you do after, 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 after uh, at home, after your time, whatever you do. They told me that you are evil. Even me and myself, they said you will be delivered. You want to be rich. If you don't go there, otherwise your richness will torment you because that man is going to make you rich because he's, he's a ritualist. Don't take these people because your, your whole family will be free. They Don't say, go there. They say I'm a ritualist. Yeah, yes, uh, they said you are a ritualist. And let's deliver this boy. Yes. Go. Bring this boy to me. Bring him. It's a small boy. Leave him. Yeah, this boy is free. Huh? At home, he loves Charis, Charis TV so much. Every so, time when he enters the house, in so my house, he the, runs when it. When demons came, what they were telling you? Hey, it's like this every day. It will be finished by stories today. I wanted to pray for everyone. Let's hear the, your story. So when the demons came, what were they saying? To you? They, they, when they came, they asked me, where are you going? Because we know that you are going to, to Makananisa. And then I said, yes, I'm going, when I answered. And then, why are you taking these people along with you? Don't take them there because he's, you, he is going to sacrifice my wife and my daughter. And then my daughter, she's in East London. And then he said, uh, they said, you're going to sacrifice them. Because, and then after that, you're going to make Save me rich. Me. Yes, you. you go, sacrifice. You're going to sacrifice them. And then you're going to take them and you're going to make, you're going to sleep with them. And then after I'll that, sleep with them. You, with them. And, then, and then after that, you will, you, you will do some, you will perform some ritualist for me to become rich. Then I said, if it is so, let it be so, because the demons have already t taken over my family. Sir. I said, if it is so, and then I will be free and I will be rich me myself, because the demons, they rendered my family up to nothing as we speak. Like you said the last time.